Roanoke County's top cop is handing over the reins. Police Chief Howard Hall retiring after a decade on the job. Ten News reporter Lindsey Kennett sat down with him to talk about his accomplishments as chief and the challenges that still lie ahead. What's he going to say? Right. I don't know. <laughs> after 36 years in law enforcement, Roanoke County Police Chief Howard Hall is turning in his badge. It's been a great career. Hall is retiring January 1st after a little over a decade as chief. Good time for me to move on and let uh, some of the excellent leadership we have in the department uh, step up into some new roles to carry forward. Hall started his career in law enforcement in Baltimore County, Maryland, where he worked for 26 years. So help me God. So help me God. He was then hired as Roanoke County's police chief back in 2012. There's a lot of things I'm really proud of. In his tenure, Hall's racked up a long list of accomplishments, from moving to data-driven policing, developing an officer wellness program that prioritizes mental health, to constructing the Roanoke County Criminal Justice Academy. A recruit that comes through either our academy or Roanoke City's Academy get their training together so they'll know each other. And as they progress through their careers uh, and they're working together, we think you know that it'll be easier. Hall promoted evidence-based training for officers to respond to mental health crises and worked with the school division to increase safety. Hall says the biggest mountain to climb was getting better pay for officers. Particularly, you know, in 2020, 2021, uh, retention, you know, really was a problem. We lost a lot of officers, and that happened across the profession. It's not a Roanoke issue or a Virginia issue. It's across the United States, so our officers now have, you know, a career path defined for them in terms of uh, compensation uh, that, you know, we think is much, much far, far better than what we had. In 2020, Hall served as president of the Virginia Association of Chiefs of Police, lobbying in Richmond on various issues and legislation, including strengthening officer decertification procedures. But he doesn't take sole responsibility for his achievements. The accomplishments we've had have been about the members of this department, you know, working very hard, trying new things, um, working with our communities, working with our county administration, our board of supervisors, our various partner law enforcement agencies um, to make things happen and help to keep our community safe. So what comes next? My wife and I are planning to do some travel. Uh, we've got a few cruises booked for next year. Hall admits challenges await his successor, particularly recruiting and retaining officers but says he feels comfortable leaving now because the department is in a good place. I'm retiring, feeling like we have accomplished what we needed to do over the last 10 years. And, you know, I'm not sure that everybody, you know, that leaves a position like this uh, can do that. I feel very good about where the department is in terms of being positioned to move forward. In Roanoke County, Lindsay Kennett, 10 News, working for you.